lot of people don't think of this very obvious thing. And that's part of why I'm far more intelligent than they are. When somebody has the mark of the beast in terms of an animal, okay, they value what an animal values. Food, you know, sex, okay, um, you know, getting petted on the ear, you know, feel good, right? Food, sex, and feel good, we'll say. And it doesn't go any deeper than that. They want to make, they want to feel tough, right? It's part of feel good. They want to make their family look good or be famous, feel good, okay? They don't have a chance because they missed the point of life, prioritization. If they're not smart enough to prioritize the point of life, obeying morality, and those of us who believe in God, God, okay, through the moral order, is the point of life. Who has proved, who has proven that they are the moral leader, obey morality through that person. If they don't get that, they don't understand the first thing in life. Heck, the number one is even A for alpha. Natural alpha, not artificial construct alpha. The point of life isn't artificial or superficial. It is supernatural. It is natural and supernatural. And it is pinpointed moral precision. If they don't get that, they're like, I'm, I'm, I'm here to beat you so I can make my race look good. I can make my kids look good. My kids can be fucked in the ass and be the next celebrity. It's fucking stupid. They're not going to last a split second in actual combat unless they poison me into next week and cripple me too. Or have me just crippled enough like they have me right now, basically, to where I can still walk and so on and so forth. But my body's very fragile. And moving too quickly could mess up my body from all the poisoning, including the blinding that has occurred. Some people want to chop it up the way, the way you did martial arts. Then why do I have to wear glasses now, you stupid fuck? You dumb son of a bitch. Okay? They wouldn't last a split second because they're too fucking stupid. It's like outmaneuvering somebody who's mentally retarded. It's not the greatest feat that ever occurred. But since my family built up, I can say with confidence, especially when I look at their cultures and the cultures that they're a product of, that I'm the top martial artist ever. Okay? No one is ever as smart as I am. And these people have been building toward fucking the beast goal every generation. They've been building away from wisdom. The fruit of the righteous is wisdom, as the Bible would say. The fruit of the fruit of the wickedness, the fruit of the wicked rather, is stupidity. Folly is in the heart of a child, right? They're stupid and they're breeding down. So their intelligence, even after fuming me all these years, is like a dog compared to mine. They're a mere beast. They're a mere beast of the field. Their best A, which is beast scrambled, is a beast. It's fucking stupid. Okay, it is insane not to know that I'm the top martial arts. Look at people's arguments. Look at their lifestyles. How smart could they be? They choose money and social norms in a world run by pedophiles where one in five CEOs by their own corporate culture are said to be psychopaths. How many are sociopaths? How many are narcissists? How many are, are fixated weirdos, pedophiles? I mean, they're all scum. They follow scum and they can't transcend the basic traps of fucking idiots. How the fuck smart could they be? How the fuck smart could they be? I'm in the moral repetition that everyone who follows my videos knows I'm in. Big Brother knows. Big Brother has no doubt in my mind. Everyone, excuse me, no doubt in their mind that everyone's a bitch compared to me. It doesn't take analyzing me for years to understand that. It takes about as long as it takes to see that a lion could rip up a cat to understand that. Now think about a lion mixed with a, the smartest person that ever lived in the, in the brain compared to a pussy cat mixed with a pussy in their brain. Think about it. 